But I've been absolutely clear with President Putin. He has no misunderstanding. If any, any assembled Russian units move across the Ukrainian border, that is an invasion. But it will be met with severe and coordinated economic response that I've discussed in detail with our allies, as well as laid out very clearly for President Putin. But there is no doubt, let there be no doubt at all, that if Putin makes this choice, Russia will pay a heavy price. There's also not the only scenario we need to be prepared for. Russia has a long history of using measures other than overt military action to carry out aggression. And paramilitary tactics, so-called gray zone attacks, as, and actions by Russian soldiers not wearing Russian uniforms. Remember when they moved into the Donbass, the little green men? They weren't, they, they were dealing with uh, um, those uh, who were Russian sympathizers and uh, said that Russia had no, nobody in there. Well, that includes little green men in uniforms as well as cyber attack. We, we have to be ready to respond to these as well in a decisive and united way with a range of tools at our disposal. The Ukrainian foreign minister said this morning that he's confident of our support and resolve, and he has a right to be. Hey, thanks for watching Bloomberg Quick Take Now. Subscribe to our channel to see the biggest stories the moment they happen from around the world. And tune in to our 24-7 live stream for global news coverage, documentaries, interviews, deep dives, and shows on the stories that you care most about.